had everybody talking today. The I-25 southbound exit at Rock Rim and closed for a herd of cattle that found some new grazing <laughs> space, as you see there. And jokes aside, it's a miracle that none of the cattle or the passersby were injured. Our Sam Kramer was there as Cowboys wrangled up the cattle. He's in studio tonight. And uh, Sam, this was a sight to see. Yeah, the cattle were headed south to their winter pasture when the trailer malfunctioned, letting a small herd of them loose. And it took a little time, but with the help of some cowboys, those cows came back home. It's one of those only in Colorado calls. I cows out the roadway. People are trying to stop and herd the cows back into the trailer. That had everyone talking. Again, lots of calls coming in on this one. Around 10.30 this morning, we were there as these cattle were grazing near the I-25 southbound exit at Rock Rimmon. But just moments before, they were almost part of a major traffic accident when the trailer they were riding in swung open. One of the safety features on it malfunctioned and the trailer came open caused a couple of the cows came out actually on the interstate. CC women's soccer coach Jeff Bennett saw it happen, tweeting his surprise that the cattle tumbled yet got up unscathed. Somehow, Peter says no one was hurt, including those cattle. The cows didn't appear to be very injured. There was some, they were scraped up just a little bit. Once they gathered in the grass, Springs police shut down the exit so that cowboys could lead the herd all the way to the Pro Rodeo Hall of Fame as ranch hands drop so-called cattle cake along the way. Most of the time you have your cows try to get them trained to where when you shake the bag that it's in or the bucket or whatever that it's in, they know that that's good eating for them so they'll, they'll gra gravitate towards that feed. It all took about 45 minutes to an hour before those roads were reopened again. Amazing that none of those cows or the other drivers on I-25 were injured here. Always watching out for you, Southern Colorado. I'm Sam Kramer, News 5.